everybody. Well, the Wichita Public Library has something for just about everybody. We have Stephanie Huff with the library here to tell us more about it. Steph, let's first start off by talking about what you guys have for book lovers. Yeah, well, obviously for the library, we have a lot of things for book lovers. Um, coming up in May, there's a special event, though, that's, I think, keen on those book lovers who really want to get their first look at the new th books that are coming out. Uh, it's an event we call Book Buzz with Random House, where a representative from Random House Publication is coming to the Westlink Library. This is the first Wednesday in May. And they're going to have the books that haven't been released yet for spring and summer available to hand out. So people are getting books that haven't even been published yet. The first look at some of the more popular or the highly anticipated books coming out this summer. So it's a really unique event for those true, you know, diehard book fans who want to get that first look at the, the new books. Have you guys ever done anything like that before? Uh, I don't think we've done anything like that for a while. It's sort of like unique opportunity. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the library receives these books. They're called advanced reader copies. They're not meant for publication. There might be errors. There might be little things that still are going to get changed. So it's sort of that sneak peek, unique look into the publishing industry, you know, to see a book not quite ready for publication yet. And so there's a limited number of those books available. That's right. It's very limited. They can't be sold. They're just for, for copies, for preview purposes. And you get a couple weeks with it, or is there a time limit? Oh, well, we're giving them away. And so these are books that are coming out for spring and summer. So you'll be getting books that maybe are won't get published until July or August. And um, you'll just get to keep them, like I said, because we can't sell them, so give them away. Sounds like a heck of a deal. Yes, exactly. And also giving away, we have a comic book event coming up. Um, and we have comic books at the library, graphic novels, and there is, uh, the first Saturday in May, there's a celebration called Free Comic Book Day, where different places give out free comic books, and the library is going to be a part of this. We're going to give comic books out. We're going to have events in the morning and in the afternoon at the Central Library, where if you uh, come, you can get a free comic book. And then I understand you guys also have something for local history buffs. That's right. So every month we do an event with the Wichita Genealogical Society, and these are the guys who know all about history and genealogy. And they do a presentation the third Saturday of uh, the month at the Alfred Branch Library in the afternoon. And this month, Goat Glands to Ranch Hands, it's the story of the history of KFDI Radio. Oh, cool. so with a title like that, you know, it's got to be a pretty good history, a pretty good story. So they'll be making that presentation. Did you say goat glands? Goat glands <laughs> to ranch hands. And I don't know what that means. So I'm, <laughs> I'm really intrigued to know how the story is. I think there's a lot of radio stations have such unique history of how they came about. Mm -hmm. And so this is KFDI story. We'll have to check that out. Yes. So if people want to learn more about these events, where should they go? They go to our website. Of course, we updated our website this past year, www.wichitalibrary.org. It's very user-friendly. You'll see events right at the top. Click that. That takes you to our calendar. It'll show you everything. It'll allow you to customize if you just want to look by an age range or if you just want to look by the location, library location closest to you uh, or just technology classes. I mean, we have such a variety of events. We have them all listed at our website, wichitalibrary.org. All right. Well, Steph, thanks so much for the preview. Thank you. And thank you for watching the City 7 News Now Update.